and I am doing the my first time tag. So I have the questions and it sounds naughty, but it's not. So um, let's do it. Question number one, first tweet. Um, I had to download my archive and my first tweet was eating a Fiji apple. Yum. That was on April 11th, 2008. <laughs> I like apples. Question number two, first YouTube video. It was Rat Cupcake Song. I'm gonna pull it up for you because it's an experience. Oh, this tag is brilliant. to on YouTube um, I'm pretty sure that's Venetian princess because I used to love her music video parodies so that was my first sub sub first Facebook profile pic ooh I'm gonna go find that out 13 13 13 13 13 13 I'm fine. Found it! See, right there, first profile pic on Facebook! Do you still talk to your first love? Um, I've never been in love. I've had where I think I've loved someone, but it hasn't been like in love, so I don't even know what that is. And no, I don't talk to my ex at all, for good reasons. First alcoholic drink. Um, you guys already know this, but it was Smirnoff, it was my freshman year in college, and it was nasty. What was your first job? Uh, my first job, I worked at a bagel shop, and they had to carry special insurance, and I got paid $5 an hour, and it was in junior high. I think I was 12, I think I was 12, and I had to be there at 5 in the morning. And I had these big, long, fake nails, and it was disgusting because I always had to clean them out because of the cream cheese and the bagels and bleh. What was your first car? Um, my first car was a hand-me-down. It was my brother's car. He, it was an old black Mercedes, and my brother put two 15-inch subs in the trunk, and they used to drain the battery, and I'd be, like, driving at night, and the lights would dim when the bass would hit, so it'd be like, don't, don't, don't. But, um, yeah, and I'd have to get it jumped all the time, and it had no get up and go on hills. It was like, putt, 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 but it was a car. Who was the first person to text you today? Um, pretty sure that was Jack Vale. He's like a prankster on YouTube, I don't know if you know. I think we're gonna do some videos together, so. Yeah, have you had coffee? I don't drink coffee, but that was Jack. Who was the first person you thought of this morning? <laughs> Myself. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um... I don't want to tell you that, cause I it's 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 private. I'm blushing. Oh my god. Who was your first grade teacher? Um, I actually after kindergarten went to a private school that my parents had at their house, and they hired this like teacher, and then kids they basically like turned the bottom lower level of our our house into a school, and it was a private school because like we weren't getting a good education. And her name was uh, Brenda Wilcox, and she was amazing. So I was like first through third grade. I went to school at my house, which is just, that's just totally normal. Where did you go on your first ride on an airplane? Um, I think they took me to Norway when I was like eight weeks old or something. Yeah. Who was your first best friend and do you still talk? Um, my first best friend, her name was Brittany Halfley. And I was on swim team and we were at a, a meet in, I think it was Cottonwood, Arizona. And I think it was like this, the semifinals. And um, they're like, Brittany, whatever. And we're like, yeah. And we're like, wait, your name's Brittany too. And she spelled her name B-R-I-T-N-I. And I was like, you know, we should go to Sizzlers after this. So I think we went to Sizzlers with our families. And my brother had like the biggest crush on her. But we were friends like all the way through junior high and high school. And then we kind of like, we just kind of grew apart just because it was hard because she lived in Kingman and I lived in Sedona. And I saw her like once at school, but really no connection anymore. Sad. Where was your first sleepover? Uh, my first sleepover was at my friend Malika's house, and my mom had <laughs> my mom had to come get me in the middle of the night because I wanted to go home because I was like homesick. I was just yeah yeah. What was the first thing you did this morning? Um, I picked up my phone and looked at all my notifications. I'm so addicted to this sucker. Not even funny. What was the first concert you went to? Um, it was Black Street and New Edition and I was very little and I thought it was so cool. I don't even know if you guys even know the song. Like, I like the way you work it, yo diggity. You gotta bag it, bag it up. It was way back in the day. First broken bone. I haven't broken any of my bones. Knock on something. Ugh. First piercing, um, I got my ears pierced when I was 15 
and I remember getting it done and I like screamed because the gun was so loud so I was like they're like and I'm like ah! <laughs> but um yeah I didn't and then you know then I got my cartilage but that's all I have first foreign country you've gone to was Norway when I was eight weeks old thanks parents first movie you remember seeing uh the first movie I remember seeing was Flashdance because my mom was obsessed with it like she had the CD and the tape and everything, so, and she would just cover our eyes on any of like the naughty parts, but she watched it all the time. When was your first detention? Um, I never had detention. I know, I just, I never really did anything wrong. I got in fights, like I had to go to the principal's office, but I had never had detention. Who was your first roommate? Uh, my first roommate was... Um, probably in college, um, the, I don't remember what her name was, she was the one that like thought she was a witch and like told everyone that if they needed a love spell, like they could come visit her and painted like Sailor Moon stuff on the outside of our dorm room. And like she was like so messy and she hated me and I was so scared of her. But yeah, that was like my first roommate experience. If you had one wish, what would it be? Um, I probably wish for my dad to still be alive, but like I understand. <laughs> If I'm being honest, but I think that, you know, that's, it's a natural progression in life, so it just makes you really appreciate all the good things. What was the first sport that you were involved in? Um, I played t-ball. <laughs> they have the cutest pictures, I need to find them, of me with like a big baseball cap, and I'm like just teeny tiny. So, um, oh, but then, actually no, maybe swimming was before t-ball, because my mom lied and told them that we were like five or whatever age you have to be when we were like three and four because we were tall so we didn't look like we were you know and we were pretty mature kids so yeah I think swimming was probably first sport. What is the first thing you do when you get home? Um, I take off my shoes and I go and sit on my computer and I look at like all my like social media sites and respond to comments and I, yeah I love my computer. When was your first kiss? Um, well I pulled a boy into a bathroom and kissed him when I was five at, um, you guys know this story too, or most of you probably do when I was in kindergarten, so, but I don't know if that counts, but my first, like, real, real kiss, I think I was, like, 15, it was my boyfriend Gabe, and it was messy and gross, and, um, I hopefully am a lot better now than I was then, because it was just embarrassing. Oh yeah, I did it, I did it, I'm gonna put the questions below if you want to do this, and I tag all of you, like, anybody can do this first time tag, but, um, hopefully you liked learning a little bit more about moi, and I'm gonna go, I'm alone, and I'm free.